Alright, well, it looks like the battle has started. I rushed to take the forest over here. Because this is my defense position. I didn't bother to take the support hill to my left because I'd just be more ground to defend. So I'll just have my brave hidden. These units can hold their own, especially forest. This will stop a lot of bullets, so they can hold their own. My voltageurs will retreat into the forest after getting about four kills in exchange for a lot. The Russian 17th Jaeger moved up after cover from some Russian militia. But they're not going to win this fight. Just they're horribly outnumbered and shooting into a forest. And these things stop a lot of bullets. This won't actually stop much now that I think about it. Here comes a uh, the Lancers charging those light infantry. Well, they're just going to get shot up. This is overall not a pretty charge. And here comes, he sent some cab down to get my volts. My brave get their shots off. Kill 12 of those 15th Hussars. And now he should be in range of the Swiss foot over here to take shots. Those volts will live, I hope. Well, here becomes the charge. He's going to pull back his 10th Hussars. He doesn't want to lose them. Because he's slowly, I'm withering away his calf for us. And now he's going to shot. That calf's not going to survive. Although now his lights are in range. So I'm going to pull my volts off to watch the right now. Yeah, just seeing what he's capable of. My two volts are firing out of a forest. This was just a fun game we played. It wasn't really to win anything. But it was definitely a fun battle. Some people's eyes. But it was a good game all around. Uh, Russia. Russia's a ho probably the hardest faction to use in this game. Other than probably like Sweden or something. They're just a near worthless faction. They got the Mounted Jaegers, which are pretty great, but the line's garbage. So the Cavs, nothing special. But, you know, it doesn't come down to the faction, it comes down to the player. But the faction determines how the player plays. And the Russian line is a joke when it comes to shooting. They're a melee based faction. Here I threw down some stakes to prevent, to discourage another one of those charges that came down and harassed me earlier. Here comes British charge down the right, but he's going to run into voltage yours and my brave. And. These brave know it's coming. Here it comes. They're just gonna punish. Oh, they're punishing the cold stream. Now oh, these foot guards. Hold the space bar. I can see. Oh. Oh, wrong button. Camera troubles there. Lows. Now. All right. Well, I'm able to help him kill that foot. Help him do what he can. Let's see. It's a little known trick. Stakes stop bullets. It's very handy to learn. It's kind of a bug, but at this point, this game's not getting patched ever, so. It's just a smoke cloud everywhere at this point. I don't know how the troops see anything. Guess that's why forests stop bullets. You can't even see who you're shooting at. Crouching Taiga. It's his now. Yeah. He's going for my general, which honestly, I don't even care about. He's just a general staff, and at this point, it's just the old guard and guard seamen that are remaining, and they're all already inspiring each other. I canceled the tier fire because that unit broke, so I need to reaffirm my position in the front. The guard seamen still holding the line there. They're fine. Well, actually, they're reforming right now. I'm getting slaughtered. Down. So here we just got a point blank shootout. They're like what, 20 meters away? And he forms. I force. I make him form square because I got that cavalry supremacy now. So he's gonna send his general in. He's gonna charge his general through his own square into my cab, and I'm okay with that. I mean, I'll let my guard team and shoot at that square all they want. Old guard holding the front. There's a run in, trying to save the flank on the right. 
It looks like now he's gonna. Now he's charging. He's moving in, and instead of a melee, he's gonna go for a shootout, which I enjoy because he's shooting through a forest, and I'll take that. My old guard have ridiculous reload. Here we go. Now I'm gonna set up another layer of tier fire for a third. These old guard are holding f right back, and the guard seamen are holding the line here. Although they're getting hit hard. And they're tired, so this they're gonna suffer a lot of casualties in that melee. Although they are wavering, so the melee's not gonna last long. Here's rushing his lineup. He's gonna try to outflank me with his lights. And right here, one of my lines about to break. Here I sent my other cab in to help out my guard seaman. Because now they can't form square. I want him. I need him elsewhere and set up. Because I see cold stream guards coming. I don't like that. His light are very tired. So if I get into melee with them, they're gonna break very shortly. Which is what I do decide here. I'm gonna send my cavalry back. Broke those lights with my guard seaman in melee. Now they're gonna reform in the back. Huh. Why not just a straight up shootout? Bar says he's winning. He thinks he's winning. But I know those I'm light winning. infantry, because. And I also send my general staff in to get those lights. He's forming square there, so he's suffering reduced firepower. Here he charges through the forest, and he's getting knocked down by the old guard. Plus, the old guard is just going to scare him now that his general's dead. Nah, no, his general's routed, not dead. His charge bonus has suffered a reduction. Here you go, my old guard into melee. They're going to win that because the foot's tired. Hmm. I'm running to set up my guard team to fight those cold stream before they can come in and wreak havoc throughout my lines. So it's just a lot of micromanagement at this point. And waiting and watching. Here I broke his lights, and now I'm forcing that unit to stay square. Which means he can't be part of an offensive, which is going very poorly for him, and he needs the troops. Here my guard seaman should be able to get off a volley on those cold stream. Well, they're very tired versus my tired, so I'll win the melee. So, right now, the objective has been the same right since the beginning of the battle hold this forest. Call my general back. This cab unit is still keeping him in square, so he can't do anything. And the battle is slowly shifting to my favor. This old guy's got two chevrons and ran out of ammunition, I believe. No, they did. I don't know if they did. But they're countercharging. Make sure that unit doesn't come back. Get my cavalry to attack those light infantry. At this point, he just got routing units. The old guard is just scaring the troops he has left away. Keep that unit in square. Right. No other unit will fight down to 18 men with the general staff. And now the battle's in my favor, finally by the bar. After this bloody fight for the forest. Our men are running, sir. Death. If they don't have yellow, they're dead British. If they have yellow, they're my dead infantry. Dead Swiss. 
here I'm gonna just gotta crush that last two pockets of resistance, that unit right there. It's getting charged by old guard. And they're wavering just by the presence and the thought of being charged by the most elite troops. They give off a rally and that's the game. He gets out of square, charged with the general. Alright, broke that unit. And it's just his cav left. Which he's walking. They're probably gonna wrap before the shots even get fired. One of our units has used oh, all its ammunition, sir. Well, we can observe the carnage that went on between the Russians and the British earlier. Ba -da -da -da. But good game to my opponents. I guess kills. Old Guard with 195. Guard Seaman 194. Brave. Wow, my cab was worthless. So was my Swiss. Oh well. Alright, good games to my opponents and teammates. See you next time.